Hey guys, Christy Dunphy here with the Dunphy Group. It's time for that Monday market update. We're a little bit late in the day today, but let's get this done. If you like my videos, give me a heart, give me a thumbs up, comment or below and let me know. If you have any questions, please reach out. So in the last seven days, 203 homes hit the market, 26 homes had price decreases, and 25 homes came back on the market. Pending and under contract, total of 382 right now, and in the last seven days, 261 homes sold. Good numbers. I'm off market, only two. Um, one number that we haven't been uh, reporting on because it hasn't been, um, there hasn't really been any in the past, is pre-foreclosures. Last week there was 21, or the week before there was 21, and this week um, on the report today there were 16 foreclosures filed last week. Um, so the numbers are higher on that than they've been in the past. Um, active homes for sale, 457. Resale and existing homes is 288. So the, everything above that is your uh, new homes. 249 of those are single family homes and 39 are townhomes and condos. So we still have an inventory issue. We, we more have an issue if there's too many buyers from the amount of homes that are coming on the market. So um, break it down by price range. Um, three homes under 200, eight homes in the two to 300 range. It's not much, you guys. Three to 400 range, there's 46, and the four to 500 range, there's 62. Um, there's just not a lot for sale. When we talk about 249 single family homes available in the county, the resale homes, that's every price range. That's your mobile homes on land all the way up to your multi million dollar uh, mansions uh, for sale. Highest price home in the market, still an $8 million house. So, again, if you guys want to go see that and you've got the, the money, let's go. Let's go look at it because I want to see it too. Anyway, you guys have a wonderful evening. We'll see you next time.